Hey YouTube, what's going on? It's Uncle Tony 99 It's Tony. How are you guys doing? Today I'm going to have a bit of an application review for you guys. Um, there's a new application out today called Multiflow. I think it came out today, I'm not sure. Anyway, it's called Multiflow. Multiflow. And basically what it allows you to do is have um, multitasking on your iPhone, similar to the Palm Pre with cards. Um, there is another application out called mQuickDo that allows you to multiple, uh, switch between applications running in the background on your iPhone. But um, I think this Multiflow might be better. Um, I'm, I've been using it for you know today and uh, I downloaded it this morning and installed it and I've been using it and I really like it. So um, I'm going to show you today basically how to get it on your iPhone. Now, before we get started, I really need to mention that you do need to be jailbroken in order to run this. Um, as you can see, I jailbroke using Black Rain, and uh, I installed installed Cydia as well as the Rock Store. Um, so, in order to use MultiFlow, you're going to need to have Backgrounder, this application right here, on your iPhone. So, what you're going to do is you're going to go into Cydia or the Rock Store, whichever one, and you're going to find Backgrounder, and you're going to download it. Um, so we'll just launch Cydia here and let it load cool. and then we're going to go over here Ooh. to manage or no, no. Tony. Hi baby, Tony's making a video. Okay. It's reloading data and you're going to scroll down uh, here to featured packages and then go over here and if you scroll down uh, there you go. There's Backgrounder. It enables multitasking on your phone. So you're going to download that and install it and then reboot your phone. Um, you should always reboot your phone after every time you install an application. I always do and I rarely run into problems. So once you have that installed and you've rebooted, um, you're going to go over here to the Rock Store. And you do need to have a Rock account. So you'll need to sign a, set up an account if you don't have one using your email address and a password and as you can see sign in is complete so on and so forth and then you're going to go over here and here you're going to find multi-flow um, what's new in rock multi-flow right there as you can see right there is multi-flow and there's a the description so basically you're going to install that I already have installed and this does include a free 10 day trial so if you decide that you don't like it, you don't need to pay the $4.99 for it initially, you can try it out free for 10 days, and if you like it, then, you know, you can go ahead and pay the 5 bucks for it. Um, so you're going to launch Backgrounder. Once you have both of those installed, um, and you've rebooted your device, you're going to install Backgrounder, and then you can simply use whatever applications you want uh, running in the background. Launch those. Here's my Facebook. And then you're going to press and hold your home button down. And as you can see, backgrounding enabled. Um, any other applications you want running, maybe you want to keep your Twitter running. So you'll launch your Twitter client. I use Twitter Um Twitter is my personal favorite. Again, press and hold your home button down. Backgrounding enabled. And uh, what else do you want running? Maybe Skype. Might want to have Skype running in the background all the time. You know, that might be cool. That way you can stay online on Skype all the time. This version of Skype is only supported on Wi-Fi. Yes, I know that. And there's my Skype people. Um, I don't use Skype a lot, but I do have it on my phone. So backgrounding is enabled. Again, press and hold your home button down and enable it in Backgrounder. Um, so once you have applications that you want running in multitasking, um, all you're going to simply do is double-click my camera's light's not very good in here, but my finger's on my home button. Double click it. And as you can see, here you have all your applications running in a page flow sort of style, just like the cards on the Palm Pre. Um, very cool. And just simply tap the one you want to open. And bang, there's your Facebook. Um, you want to switch between applications, double click again, go back to your springboard, um, double click again. And uh, you can go over here to, say, your Twitter. 
bang, there you go. And these all stay running in the background all the time. So it you know, really does provide true multitasking on the iPhone. Um, I don't know why Apple hasn't enabled this yet. Um, probably part of the reason they say is battery life. Um, I have noticed that my battery has gone down a little quicker today than it normally does. But then again, which is why it's plugged in and charging. But then again, I have been using it more. So you can also enable your iPod and play music while you're using other applications using this as well. Um, so this is really cool. Um, I really like this multi-flow, much more so than the M Quick Do. M Quick Do provides you with a little bar here along the bottom and you press have to hold it and swipe up and that opens up a spring page and then you can spring to the other applications. This one's very simple. It's just a simple double click of your home button and here's your mail, Facebook, Twitter, um, Skype's running, your iPod's going, um, and they're all running at the same time, and you can simply just jump to whichever application you want, or back to your springboard, whatever you want to do. Um, this is a really cool application so far. I really, really like it, and um, I think that's about it for this video. I just wanted to show you guys this multi-flow. Um, it's really, really kind of cool. Um, that's about it. All right, so um, I told you where to get it if you're interested. You know, you have to be jailbroken, obviously. I used Black Rain. Um, and then you install Cydia and Rock. Go through the steps that I outlined earlier in the video. And there you go. You got multitasking, just like the Palm Pre on your iPhone, um, which is super cool. You can also be using an application, say playing a game and simply jump to other applications and then jump back to your game without having to reload the whole game which is very cool um, I could show you that if you want um, what do we play still got a couple minutes left here before I have to stop uh, something that takes a while maybe Gangstar Gangstar is a pretty popular game so we're going to load that Loft. I'm going to skip the intro. There you go. So, double, I'll press and hold your home button down. Backgrounding's enabled. Music's still playing. Double click your home button. And you can jump over here to your Twitter. Check your Twitter. Double click again. And you're back over to Gangstar without having to reload. Very cool. Really, really like it. Um, I have been wanting backgrounding on the iPhone, or multitasking on the iPhone. It's really the only thing, in my opinion, that the iPhone was missing. And here you go. You got it. You have to be jailbroken to get it, but here it is. All right, so that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. I hope this guy uh, has helped you guys out a little bit. And uh, we'll see you next time, okay? Later.